Hey guys, it's me, your best friend Joe. Welcome back to Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze. This is part nine. Is that what I just Number said? Nine. This let's play uh, back here with my best fella, Justin. This is probably going to be on a Thursday, though, so it's two days. Two days. Two days after two day, two day, two day Tuesday. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my, oh my, oh my god. Did I you ever see. Did you ever watch the publicity? Okay, Nick, the Nick Roll show or whatever. Nick Kroll. Nick Kroll. Yes. And then the publicity sketches. Those were the only ones I ever saw on his thing, but I loved them. Uh, I've, you know, I've, I actually didn't like his sh that show too much, but I like him, and I like like little sketches. But I could, like, it was kind of a bit too much to watch like the whole thing. But every every time I watch like a single a sketch, single sketch, then they were pretty good. Yeah. Speaking of things, movies that are on. Things, movies are things. <laughs> that was the transition into last episode. So, yes, when last you were going to we were... start listing every single movie you've ever seen in your life. Well, because somebody thought that maybe the only movie that I've ever seen is Going Bananas. Sure, and, and oh, how wrong they are. So, I have, right. well, I right. have kind of like two categories of movies. Uh, movies yeah. that are like, I would say, are kind of classy and on like the AFI. The Criterion, Top 100, collection. Criterion Collection type of movies is one category, and then there's movies that have, like, spoiler alert, talking animals. The Dog Who Saved Christmas. The, the Dog Who Saved Christmas, yes. Um, and uh, which we've already, unfortunately, talked about in this series. Um, Ed is also, oh, see, but like Ed with Matt LeBlanc with a movie, it's a monkey movie where. Who is Ed? Ed is. Is that a monkey? It's a monkey that plays baseball. With Matt LeBlanc. Matt LeBlanc. This was Matt this LeBlanc. This is before or after Friends. This was uh, possibly during Friends. I, I am afraid of what's happened. Do you see this? Wow. Oh my. I got fucking blown to smithereens. Yeah. Okay. This is, wait, before or after Friends. Sorry. I, I believe during Friends. This was, oh. you know, like he was popular from Friends already and kind of like, because Jennifer Aniston, I think, made a couple movies during Friends, you know, and. But hers, yeah. I mean, not weren't great, but wasn't like well, Ed with a, you know, the monkey. I mean, that sounds awful. He but plays baseball. It's, it's, the monkey is about as realistic as Bonzo and going bananas. Is it a CGI monkey or like No, what's the... it's definitely a person in a monkey suit. Oh, I see what I have to do. I just have to go really fast. You just have to go fast. Okay. Oh, 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 there. I think he hit it with his butt once. Dang. Anyway, you like this movie with Matt LeBlanc? So, I mean, okay, but it, it's... I mean, you do? He can't talk, but that's the that's another movie with a, Oh, the a monkey, monkey can't talk. The monkey genre, or talk... Monkeys in our genre, or talking animals genre. But then I have, like, my maybe more legit... Um, Oh, he's pulling up a nap, Movies. guys. Got, so Google Keep. Google, he's got it. Oh, I actually have Google Keep lists of... I keep lists of South Korean, Japanese, um, Chinese movies I've seen, like horror movies and other movies, because I used to help watch a whole bunch of those and I wanted to keep lists. But you just have you just have lists, of, like American movies. Uh, these are So this one is something I did probably years ago, um, at least like two or three years ago. But that is in the kind of like someone was asking me, oh, what movie? You know, like uh, Joe, our friend, my, our other friend Joe, was mm -hmm. like, oh, what movie should I watch? And so I made a list and gave it to him. And this was, I think, the list that I'd sent him. And so, um, and it's really like one title, but it's also like representative of other titles too. I'll go in. So like wow. Animal Crackers, Marx Brothers. Okay. It's like an old school comedy, and I so I would put, you know, stuff like The Jerk, and I, which I which I which I like. I know you don't like Steve Martin much, but The, the Jerk. I don't mind ways. him, but but like uh, I like him when he's in movies with Hilary Duff, like Cheaper by the Dozen. Well, the he's a also classic. in um, The Man with Two Brains has Kathleen Turner in it, which I think you would like. Oh, who's Kathleen Turner? See, Cereal I. Mom. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, so I do, I loved Serial Mom when you yeah. showed that to me. Yeah, that um, was good. And that's not even on the list. That was that was a fun. That's a fun. But John Waters movies, those are, those are like, those are fun. We were in the middle of Pink Flamingos. But I we needed a break. We yeah. had, that was like 
it, there's three this, months ago, and we haven't. Well, there's a scene where. Okay, okay, spoiler alert. It's literally a spoiler. Okay, first of all, this is topical because um, Sh Eureka dressed as Divine on yes. this past week. Of, yes. She channeled Divine for her evil. Uh, for the look, saboteur. For the runway. For her saboteur. The saboteur. Look. And uh, so we were watching. What's the movie actually called? Pink Flamingos. Pink Flamingos, starring Divine. And in it. Divine doesn't take part in this scene, but there is, spoiler alert, a couple that has sex with... A chicken. A chicken. A live chicken, and the chicken dies during the sex. In real life. In, like, this is, and it in all happened. Scene. And then after that scene happened, I was like, I need a break from this movie <laughs> real quick. And, that, well, the, the whole point of the movie is Divine is trying to be the worst person in the world. The most vile. The most vile person in the world. And, uh, I... Spoiler alert for you, like, okay. there's stuff that Divine does that is definitely on par with, if not above the chicken fucking scene, so. Oh, really? Yeah. You know about the stuff I've, in the movie? I've read about, because I read, like, because it's like, at some point, you, there's no more spoiler alerts after 50 years. Well, yeah, I long. agree. I would agree with that. I, I hate saying spoiler alert after that amount, after... After like about a year, honestly, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm sick of saying spoiler alert. Well, okay, well I guess we'll have to finish the movie and I'll see more of this, uh, more of the interesting things that will happen. All right, but so that's just kind of a tangent. Um, so Quentin Tarantino movies, I've you know I've liked those. So Kill Bill, the, the, both of the Kill Bills are probably my favorite. I actually like two a little bit better, but I like the Kill Bill movies. Yeah, um, and then we well we watched Pulp Fiction. Yeah. Um, Reservoir Dogs is pretty good. Sometimes uh, I get. Sometimes when movies are like super stylized, I think that I think that some directors run the risk of like to making some movies too stylized to the point where like like stylized movies are supposed to be different, but then they all start feeling the same once yeah, they've all been super I think, stylized. Like someone that. Because I watched Pulp Fiction, like, in the theater. That was, like, one of the first, like, R-rated movies that I was able to go see. And so, it, uh... Back then, it was very, like... Fr and I was kind of like, this is weird, you know? Like, but it, now, like, it's so like many tank. people have copied it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, yeah. I get it. And we watched Boogie Nights. That's on here, too. That Dirk and Diggler. So just look uh, at these butts that are spiky. <laughs> these are just spiky butts. All right, I'm surprised I got through that level. I was having to concentrate pretty hard. That was. But I'm a pro. I can do this. So well, you know? yeah. I'll be on easy mode. <laughs> See, oh, Sea Free Cuz is the Sea world. Breeze. I think we've been in this whole time. We should be coming up on a boss. Oh, this is this should be the boss. Oh battle. my goodness, the store. What was the black and white movie that you watched where the the son gets kidnapped? And Fugu Face... Wait, what's Fugu? Is that an eel? Fugu? This is called Fugu Face Off. Oh, oh, no. Oh, yeah. sorry. No, I wasn't I thought you were about that a movie. movie. Yeah. My brain's all over the place right now. No. Um, high but, and Low. With, that's Kurosawa. So we've watched... That's Kurosawa. So Ikiru is probably my favorite movie, which is at the top mm -hmm. of this list that we're talking about. But that is... Uh, uh, Kurosawa, particularly the stuff that he did up until Redbeard, I think is all really good and it's a very different perspective and kind of like what it means to you know like american movies like everything ends anything? up all right and it's and yeah what is this i don't i just dove all the way down to the bottom or surely i missed something maybe american movies are they're just kind of like oh everything ends up being okay if that's the only way oh, go. um that you know Oh, I hate it when I hate it when things turn out okay in movies. That's why Lost in Translation is one of my favorite movies. Map of the Sounds of Tokyo. Yes. Because they don't end well. Look at that cutie. And not that there's. Oh, oh, oh my, my gosh. That would be Piggy. He's got a little bit of an underbite. He yeah, does. he does. He's Piggy so also got his teeth pulled. Oh my god, he got nine teeth pulled when he got neutered. And there's this a reason is, for that. Like, they wasn't it. just being mean. It's his baby teeth that should yeah. have fallen yeah, out. Yeah, right yeah, yeah. His basically. baby teeth got. And I guess if they don't fall out soon enough and they the other ones start growing, then that's bad, so. I think Fugu. Oh my god. I just ran right into those spikes. These butt plugs lining the oh fucking god. walls. Uh, Funky Kong's got some pecs. Did you see him? 
Whoa. I don't. Oh, I think I'm supposed to hit him in this in this fluffy part. Probably. Right there. Yeah. The fluffy part. The yeah. fluffy, fluffy part. Now. He's, he seems like he's got some... Okay, 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 okay. I can't swim too fast. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, boy, okay. look at these Did those guys. things hurt me? Oh, I can I can probably ping-pong those into him. Oh, God! Okay, okay, okay. I can't control myself very well underwater. I hate underwater in video games. I literally... Oh, he's pissed now. Well, and then in real life, you're not... Oh, and you then... Like yeah, swim. see? So it translates it well. It translates. I like desert worlds the most, usually, in video games. That's why I like um, Super Mario Land on Game Boy. That's the first. That's the game where Princess Daisy's introduced. Oh, really? Yeah, Mario. Oh, did you know the story about Princess? Oh my God! Oh my God! Do you know the story about Princess Daisy? Um, that you love her. Well, there needs to be justice for her. And that she's the best character in the world. You know. Well, that, right? that yeah. Well, okay. So what had done happened is. An alien came to her. She owns like four different kingdoms. She owns an entire land. It's called Sarasa Land. Okay. And um, basically, Mario came in. An alien like brainwashed all of the rulers that are beneath her, and um, they started like like she's over these rulers who rule the kingdoms. Okay, you get it. She's yeah. like an emperor, basically. Yeah. And. Um, so Mario, instead of like trying to disable their mind control, he goes and kills everybody. Wow! In all of her, that's what Super Mario Land is all about. Is basically uh, him destroying everybody in her kingdom. So now she has all these kingdoms that are just barren land. Because Mario's destroyed. Mario was a terrorist. He terrorized her kingdoms. That's pretty wrong. If it's you ask pretty me. dark. Yeah. Yeah. And so uh, that's. So, so Mario commits genocide on Daisy's he kingdom. He commits genocide in every video game he's ever in. If you think about it. I guess, yeah. What is the problem here? This guy, this is what I'm afraid of happening to Piggy because we have been trying to look up how much we're supposed oh. to be fit, feed Piggy, <laughs> feed Piggy, because he's got some new food. I don't know what to do here. He just looks like he's gonna crush me. There's no room for me to listen. Maneuvering. Oh, I think I'm supposed to hit these flappy little fucking hell. Oh my god damn it, fucking hell. I don't know how that didn't hurt. Right his face. Oh god, he blew first instead of sucked. Goodness. Wink wonk. Wugga wugga. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh my fucking oh, god. Get There's him. no way to survive this. There's no way to survive this. Okay. Okay. He's he's shrunk down to my size. That's great. Come on, turn around, turn around, buckaroo. Get him! Oh, there he is. See, I can't swim that fast. Okay, here Get we him! Go. Here we go! <laughs> oh, oh, no! Goodness, oh, that was... This boss is hard! That was so daring. We'll try one more time, okay? We'll try one more time. We'll try one more time. I hate how it fucking puts you back. You know what? We should be doing this boss two-player. No, I mean, you want to <laughs> die twice as You fast. thought about it. I think you just didn't process what I said. Well, I mean, I did, but I was like, oh, wait, I suck at this. Look, here's where you can see his pecs. Hold on, wait. Look at his chest! Dang. Funky Kong is ripped. Can I skip this? Because he's just making fun of this. I, I honestly think that this deserves to happen to Funky Kong because he just, like, made fun of this fish. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. He's a bully. He's a fucking bully. And if I lose again, I'm going to... I stop playing this game and I'll never play it again because I'll say, you know what? Funky Kong got what he deserved. He got what he deserved forever. Well, you forever. play with, with, with oh one of God. the other Grandpa Kongs or whatever there. Cranky. Cranky. And uh, Jeffrey Kong. And, and uh, little, Patricia Kong. Little Kongy. And uh, Samantha Kong. And Donk. And. Uh, Do you know their donkey. names? No, I still I, I guess, um, Crampy? Cr crampy! You got cramps, right? You just cranky! Don't... Cranky! I can't, babe, I can't fucking hit this fucking bull, fucking ass fucking piece of shit. I swear to God. Swimming in this game is a fucking nightmare. This is a nightmare. A nightmare. Oh, see, I can't do this. He's, and then he's gonna start doing it the other way, and I'm, see, I'm just not... What? Okay, there we go, oh, there we go. Bounce. I need to start doing that faster. Okay, the shells are already fallen, so he's gonna get like 12 times the size, I think. Is this it? He's definitely yeah, angry. Yeah, I'm gonna roll the ring. I'm gonna... <laughs> are you doing the voice acting hey, for him? you. Hi. I think that all the characters in this game would talk like men from the 50s. That's uh, not uh, what I talk like. Uh... That's uh, 
Oh, oh, oh! Remember when, uh, I don't remember what triggered it, but you used to say, say. Say! Say! That's all you have to do to talk like you're from the 50s is say, say! Say you! Before every word. I'm not gonna have any. Oh. He's just got some good shots on him. I this think you might did. be where he gets bigger. So, see, I can't do that. I so didn't you've have done, to, like, you've, I you've didn't just, have time. There we go. There we you've go. You've worked him over already. He's not gonna get bigger. Uh, he I think he now? spoke way too soon because I think he's about to blow up like a fucking balloon. This is it. Okay, 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 okay. Hey, see? Oh, see? Goodness. Yeah, see? He just done did it. Okay, and he's gonna keep going. He's gonna keep going. You left I wonder me if I can hit him. Now. I wonder if I can. Oh, here we go. Here we go. These blue spots right here. Yeah. Look at his little loincloth. Do you see his loincloth? Yeah, that's. I'm that glad, you know. You. That is a door. Nope. I can't hit I can't hit him anywhere. Oh my god, I'm on him. I'm actually. I can't escape this. I'm just gonna die here. I can't move. That's not fair. This is. This oh, is. Oh him. god, god, he, I can't move. Oh my goodness. I'm calling the developers. 85. Look at that balloon. This is not fair. I can't. If I can't win a video game, I don't want to play. It. Yeah. I mean, that okay. Should be the rules. You know what? I'm gonna like maybe look up a walkthrough. We'll look up a guide. And when we come back, uh, we are gonna defeat Fugu Flop bitch over here okay so thank you guys so much for watching uh hope you're still enjoying donkey kong country tropical freeze thank you as usual j dog yeah. for being here yeah. chuj 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 <laughs> <laughs> that's it you nailed it if you enjoyed this video feel free to give it a thumbs up and we will see you guys next time Boink. that was me doing a thumbs up oh okay bye guys bye, bye.